Jim McGuinness, the All-Stars announced this morning, I know every manager wants all 15. You got eight, are you happy with that? I suppose you'd have to be happy with it. Uh, obviously, you know, your heart would normally turn to the players that haven't haven't been selected, uh, you know, as a first thought, to be honest with you. Um, some of them, you know, you'd have to feel that must have been very, very close. But I suppose that's the thing about the All-Stars. It's all about opinions, really, and it's about um, a select few people picking the, the team and that you have to go with it. But um, overall, we'd be very happy. You know, eight's a, a very good tally for, for the county, you know, and I suppose it's reflective of the season that the, the boys have put in. So we're, we're very, very happy. Who would you be most disappointed for? Who do you think came closest? Well, I think I'd be disappointed. You know, you could make a case for for the four lads. You know, that didn't get in. Like I thought, Eamon, quarter final, semi final, and final, very very good games. Um, Paddy McGrath has been solid the whole way through. You know, and then obviously Rory Kavner. You know, probably in my opinion was one of our best players the whole way through the campaign. You know, so um, it's a it's a it's, it's a tricky one. You know. What about the match for Michaela here? We're in Casement Park at the moment now. You'll want to put on a show for that. You'll you'll still want Jimmy to be winning matches. Well, I don't know about that. I think it's I suppose being all Ireland champions it gives us the privilege to play in the game. I think you know, and that's the first thing. And um, you know, it's obviously a very very good uh, charity and, and a, a great event to be a part of. And we're just delighted to play any kind of part in it. And um, fingers crossed, now we can. Uh, we can get a good crowd here on the night. You know, our county final is on the following day, so that'll impact on our numbers slightly, and we probably have one or two injuries. But we're hoping to field as strong a team as we possibly can in order to make it as competitive as we can, so so people can get value for their money. But obviously, the standard of footballer that we're playing against will be very high as well. So we're wary of that. But you know, we're hoping to to give a good account of ourselves if, if we can get uh, everybody out on the field. You mentioned the cause, Jim. I take it you've got to know the people involved there very well over the last while, and you feel. To, you want to do your best for them. Well, uh, you know, when Mickey uh, approached me the night of the Ulster All Stars, you know, and he mentioned the game, you know, I just said to him, anything we can do, to be honest with you, you know, and I think, I think that uh, it goes without saying, really, you know, and uh, they've come through a very, very tough period, and um, you know, all all the the GEA community can do is support them through that, and we're delighted to be a part of that uh, on on Saturday week, and uh, fingers crossed, we'll have a, a very good event, and everything will go off smoothly, and we get a good game of football as well.